These whaling vessels are a reminder of Iceland's past. They've been kept in working order but haven't been used for more than a decade. Iceland stopped commercial hunting in 1989 under an international moratorium. Now only tourists search for these mammals. Thousands of people flock to Iceland every year hoping to catch a glimpse of the creatures in their natural environment. The whale watching business has boomed in recent years but there are fears it could suffer if Iceland resumes whaling. Strictly biologically speaking, it's no problem at all. Uh, there are, however, a lot of emotions going into the whaling issue, and, and this is actually where the impact, I believe, is going to be on the, if any, uh, uh, on the tourist industry here. In June, Iceland announced plans to resume limited whaling, but it reduced the size of the cull after widespread criticism about its decision. 38 mink whales will be killed to study their impact on fish stocks. Fishing is vital to Iceland's economy. We will not be aiming at having a profit, uh, economic profit, uh, uh, or anything like that. The only aim is to obtain valuable information uh, for uh, more reliable estimates of the role of these animals in the system. Officials say no decision on further whaling will be made until this year's results have been analysed. The first whale hunt is planned for later this week.